Welcome! In front of me I have CMF Watch Pro 2 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Basically if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your iPhone via the CMF Watch application. And once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed for the CMF Watch application and your iPhone to send the notifications to your watch. So what we need to do is to open the settings on our iPhone. So let's tap on the settings icon. In settings, we need to find the Bluetooth option and tap on it to enter. And here on the list of my devices, you should see CMF Watch Pro 2. Tap on the info icon next to it. And right here, you should see this option, share system notifications. There is a possibility that you won't see this option. And if you don't, close the settings for now. Open the CMF Watch application on your iPhone. In the app, uh, tap on the device icon to open the device page. On the device page, find the notifications tap on it and here turn off and turn on the notifications. Apparently we can't turn it off. Uh, okay, so try turning off or on the notifications for the specific uh, notification type or just wait in the app. Basically, there should be some pop up about the permissions. If you see that pop up, allow all of the permissions and after you allow them, reopen the settings. So let's find the settings icon, tap on Bluetooth, and here uh, tap on the info icon next to CMF Watch Pro 2. And now you should see this option and then make sure it is enabled. And then we can go back to the main page of settings. Here we can scroll down, find the CMF Watch application on the list of apps, tap on it, and uh, make sure that the Bluetooth option is enabled. And once it is, we can close the settings at this point and we're done with the permissions. So now we can open the CMF Watch application on our iPhone, tap on the uh, device icon to open the device page, scroll down and tap on the notifications. And here you can turn on and off the notifications um, for the specific apps and features. As you can see, we have some apps on the list. I'm gonna enable them for Discord. And how it works is basically if you enable the notification, let's say for the Discord, and you receive the notifications from Discord on your iPhone, those notifications will be forwarded to your watch. But if you disable it right here, the notifications won't be forwarded to your watch, you will see it only on your iPhone. So that's how it works. So enable the notifications for the apps you like. If you don't see the application on the list right here, you can enable the other option. And what it, what it does is basically, it enables the notifications for every application on your iPhone. And that is not in this list right here in the CMF watch application. Okay, now we can go back to the uh, device page and here we can also enable the notifications for calls. So if you tap on call reminder, tap on confirm, and then tap on the switch to enable them. And then we can go back. And at this point, you should be able to receive the notifications on your iPhone. So uh, I'm gonna... Uh, send myself a message on Discord because I enabled, enabled the notifications for Discord. So let's find the Discord and send the message. We, get, we didn't get the notification on our iPhone. Let me check if, our, if I am logged in. I should be. Where is Discord? Oh, here it is. So we are logged in. So another thing we can check is the and notifications uh, settings. So let's open the settings, notifications, look for the Discord and they are turned off for some reason. So I'm gonna tap on Discord and enable the allow notifications. And now we're gonna try again. So I'm gonna send myself another message. Oh, it didn't pop up on our iPhone, but it did pop up on our watch. So that's half the success. Uh, why didn't it pop up on our iPhone? Probably because it's even like something is changed in the notification settings. Let's see. Yeah, it's it's selected to deliver the quietly, so we can enable the badges and sounds. Uh, and 
enable everything else. Okay, and now when we send the message again, I'm gonna just write some gibberish. We got it on our iPhone and also on our watch. And if you miss the notifications on your watch, you can swipe up on the screen to open the notification panel. Okay, and that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.